Hi guys, Dom D Calix here today, and I'm going to show you how to make um, a program for the midpoint formula. Basically, you'll put in x1, y1, x2, and y2, which is your ordered pair, and it will tell you what the midpoint is of those two points. So, let's go ahead and get started here. Uh, I want to go into your programs and make a new one. Oop. Okay, and name it something probably like midpoint so you know what it is there we are alright so for this next part uh, you need to go to a different video that I have um, called clear unclear I'll leave it annotated for you guys um, because uh, this program actually runs program and a program so go click the annotation go to that video and then come back and you can finish up this one so I'm gonna program over here to clear enter all right then make a label we're just gonna make this simple and label it one then go to program write and then it's right there input and then Alpha plus is the um, um, quotation marks, and you're going to need those a lot, so that's that's where you get them. And then hit X1, and then second to math. Hit enter, so you get that equal sign there. And then hit alpha zero, and then alpha plus, then the comma, alpha A. And we're going to do that three more times. So that's your first, that's just asking you for the first um, number in the first ordered pair. And this will ask you for the second one. So again, alpha plus, alpha one, that's where his y is, and then one, and then second, math equals alpha zero, alpha plus, comma, alpha b. Alright, so that would be the y value in the first ordered pair. And here we go. Alpha plus x2 second math equals alpha 0 alpha plus comma alpha c. Enter program write input alpha or alpha plus alpha one two second math equals alpha zero alpha plus comma alpha d all right so there's x obviously x1 and y1 so that's your first ordered pair and x2 and y2 it's your second ordered pair and you just inputted the numbers then go to program write down three until it says display there hit enter then hit alpha plus and then hit the minus sign sixteen times so one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve thirteen fourteen fifteen sixteen then hit alpha plus then hit enter then hit pr second program then hit up until you see text and then hit enter and then you're gonna two comma one comma alpha plus parentheses open alpha plus comma parentheses alpha a or alpha math for a plus alpha program for c close parentheses divided by 2 comma alpha plus comma alpha plus comma open parentheses alpha apps for B plus alpha X to the negative first for D close the parentheses divided by 2 comma alpha plus 
close parentheses alpha plus and then hit enter and then hit program and scroll down until you find pause then put that in and then again uh, if you watch the other video uh, you'll probably have program unclear as well and you're gonna need that one so if not you're gonna need to go back and watch that one and get the unclear program as well so go program right and mine's way down here because I have so many so just find unclear select it put it in there or not not yet I'm sorry hit pro second program and then clear draw and then program um, and then scroll down until you find menu there it is and then type in alpha plus and then second alpha try again T R Y space again where is it? there it is and if you want to put the question mark in that's the negative sign at the bottom then hit the plus sign then hit alpha comma then second alpha um, plus y e s yes uh, alpha comma one comma ooh alpha one comma alpha plus or second alpha plus and then type in no put the plus hit plus again for the second uh, quotation there then hit alpha comma no or well it already says no two then hit enter then hit program and scroll down until you find label label two then program this is where you'll need the unclear I'm sorry it's reading my paper wrong and then hit enter and then hit program and scroll down until you find stop okay alright so now you're done and I'll just give you a preview since this video has already gotten pretty long so I'll try to make it quick so go ahead and run the program there it is midpoint alright looks good so I already wrote out a little sheet here so there's a midpoint formula x1 plus x2 over 2 and y1 plus y2 over 2 so I picked the points 1, negative 1, 5 and 7 and worked it out and 1 plus 5 and negative 1 plus 7 comes out to 6 divided by 2 so the point should be 3 over 3 so if you use this ordered pair you literally just go straight across so it would be 1 enter negative 1 enter 5 enter 7 enter and that gives us the point at 3 3 and then once you're done with that you just hit enter and it'll ask if you want to try again and if you say no it'll exit and if you say yes it'll just take you and you can input the next ordered pair thanks guys uh, if you have a video or a program you want me to make leave a comment please and I'll see you next time